dear Lebanon, your location and your diversity put you at the hub between continents and cultures. You have an impressive ability to absorb hardships. Yet you rarely confront the causes of them. Who the hell is responsible? I still can't get the images out of my head. The explosion took me reeling back, back to the days of civil war. At the end of the war, the warlords were given promises of public money. We have the same politicians, the same ones killed. They're still here, which is like, what? You have so much vested interest in the system, which led us to this very tragic situation. And why didn't the president do anything about it? I don't know. Corruption is eating up everything in the country. We have to buy bottles of water, which costs more than petrol now. The crazy floating power stations. The system will not be changed from the top. Elections are the only tool that we have. I don't believe the voting process is legitimate. So are you still confident with your decision? 100%. If we do not fix ourselves, the people will revolt against us. We Lebanese people are strong. We're very strong and we're stubborn. What is your dream for Lebanon? To become a nation. We are Lebanese! All of us! Shame on you for dividing us! These politicians, they deserve to be in jail. Enough is enough. Dear Lebanon, you're too important to let fail. We believe in the idea of Lebanon. The thing is, Lebanon, do you still believe in that idea? This is a question only you can answer.